as we have seen the rains which have seen from the june we have the experiencing of the arabian sea winds moving on and setting of the monsoons the monsoon onset we have described the what is the meaning of the word monsoons once the winds move on towards the upper part and then move on up and then settle here when they become the high pressure to low pressure regions and they become dry the regions which have experienced the cold climatic conditions here in the southern part of india also start to experience the humidity hot climatic conditions it's like normal average color like 30 degrees to 35 degrees temperatures will be experienced during the winter season also because the winds which went with the cold winds and brought rains for us have moved on up and they are not nowhere like cold winds now they are completely towards the lowlands and where it is a high temperature so we don't have that experience that kind of experience we find in the october season that's why it is called october heat because of this october heat once the land gets heated here and then becomes it's a burning place again like a semi summer region the october heat region moves on towards the upper part and the western part of india that is especially the thar desert and all the dry lands are located here from here the, again the low pressure winds start to attract the winds from the arabian sea the arabian sea sorry the bay of bengal region the bay of bengal region in the andaman coast generally we have depressions during the time of october november and december and there is no year till now where they have never experienced any cyclonic conditions or cyclone impact on this the regions which are covering the krishna godavari and kaveri regions were experience heavy damage or disaster because of the cyclones which are coming during this period these winds are attracted by the western ghats or the, the regions which are coming on the western plateau of our region like which attracts the winds towards this region that will come over to tamil nadu andhra and then they cause the damages and they sometimes move on to the bengal region also like sundarbans and bangladesh region where they cause a huge damage for us and leads to the disasters but till now india never experienced a state or like a year where they don't have any cyclone effect during this period so it is compulsory we have a cyclone from the andaman region because in the bay of bengal we have the andaman plateau conditions where we experience the cyclonic depressions occurring during this period and during this we get the attractions from the interior places where the low pressure winds are there so we get them pulled towards our region so we get that effect this effect is called retreating monsoons once the monsoons have onset settle down and leave their impact again the monsoons have rebuilding to reset it they that's why it is called retreating monsoons